all right youtube welcome back to my videos guys fm 21 tactic today it's called the go-getter and i'm not joking you you will score a lot of goals with this tactic it's brilliant and i've tested it with liverpool like i do a lot of the tactics and it seems absolutely awesome i banged in six goals past arsenal in the first game it was going absolutely brilliant brilliant tactic let me know how good you think it is in the comments of this video and tell me how many goals you scored and or if how many goals you let in with this tactic right guys so this is the goal getter tactic for fm21 right let's go in and show you it all right all and welcome back to my channel right new tactic ready for fm21 all trialed tested looking very good actually right here it is i have named this tactic because of what it does called it the goal getter and it is a goal getter will get you plenty plenty of goals right so for this tactic have the goalkeeper set on defend. You don't want a sweeper keeper in this formation. Only three at the back. Keep your goalkeeper right there. Never have him move up as a sweeper keeper or anything like that. The full back, you want normal full back on defend. So, you know, he might go forward a little bit, but he's going to help and stay in defense, you know like a modern day footballer fullback is right so then the other side as well of the fullback exactly the same on defense now the central defender you want a libero on support so you know he drops back in between the line of defense and near the midfielder so feeding that midfielder and plus you know when they're, the team are coming at you, playing through balls and stuff, the Libero will, you know, try and counter that and take out that through ball and stop the actual, you know, strikers from getting a shot at goal. He will dive in, try and get that ball and do a big job for you. And it works great, I'm telling you. And will do great on FM21. So you can use this on FM21 or FM20. It's going to work brilliantly. Right, so three midfield role as well. You've got use a wide midfielder on support. You know, he performs defensive work. Plus, helping out with that winger that's going to get those balls to the striker very, very fast, I am telling you. It's going to work great. So the other side exactly the same and then in the central of uh, midfield deep lying playmaker on defense so he's going to operate in the space between the defense and the midfield and helping out the attackers couple of through balls stuff like that is what a playmaker does as you know the wingers on support so they're going to support the strikers work out to get the ball to strikers i'll show you all that in a minute in position transition and all stuff like that so you know two strikers up front they're gonna have plenty of goal scoring opportunities so then your first striker deep lying forward so the deep lying forwards role is to sit back a little bit from the other striker help to hold up that ball so you want some sort of big player that can hold up the ball well that's got decent skill and stuff to feed the other striker which is the attacking the attacking forward the advance forward his role is just to be around that goal area and banging goals for you from left from right whichever place you want to put him and this is perfect to go with a deep lying forward works great right as I always do, set on a balanced style. You can change it depending on the team you're playing. If you're playing a team that is a lower division or something, 
go positive or whatever, but I normally start until the second half balanced. Works the best. Right. In position, the width, keep as is. Do not change any of the width. Approach play, pass into space. That is what you want. You know, so they look for that pass to get it forward quickly as possible. Right, so in here, you want... Don't use play out of defence. Not because your defence probably couldn't do it. It's because you're using three defenders, okay? Don't use that. Don't focus play through the middle. You've got all those wide areas. So you want to focus play down the left and down the right. Overlap left you could do as well and overlap right. This works brilliantly, I'm telling you. Uh, keep it standard on your passing style. Tempo. Keep as is standard. Time wasting, do not worry about that. Crosses. You want low crosses into the box. You've got two strikers there. Get that ball in as fast as possible. And hit early crosses. Play for set pieces. You can. I have tried it in this tactic. Works fine, but you don't need it. You're going to get a lot of fouls anyway for free kicks. Dribble less, no, because you've got all of those wingers and wide players you want to be dribbling down those wings run at defense click on make sure run at defense and that's it of that right in transition when you have got the board counter press important very important with this tactic get that ball forward as quick as possible when you've lost possession i wouldn't say counter hold shape Keep your shape normal when you haven't got the ball because of those three defenders. You are helped by the midfielders as well, but keep your shape. Looks, doesn't it? Like, you know, you've got no one in the centre there. Big gap between the strikers. There is no big gap. You are going to get through balls, looking perfectly, and balls spray into the right, balls spray into the left. Going to be awesome. Test this. It's brilliant. Right, goalkeeper. Uh, distribute quickly. You've got a lot to just dis distribute to, and you want him to go to distribute to the flanks. So no rolling the ball out with any three defenders. Uh, shorter kicks, right? Out of possession. Keep this fine. You're going to get offsides anyway because only three defenders. So the team's coming at you. They're going to get a lot of offsides. Do not worry about that. Point mark. Keep to your players because of only three defenders. And that Liberno, Libero is going to do a brilliant job for you. And don't say stay on your feet and don't say get stuck in. I am telling you, this tactic, it's awesome. Can I show set pieces? Uh, where we go? I'm going to show you a little corner routine here. That works brilliantly. Right. So you know you've got your player here. Yeah. Your player that's taking your set pieces. Put the best person there. And press on them. Don't do mixed. Go to near post. And then whichever your tallest player is, bring over exactly to that spot i am telling you the amount of goals i have scored with tactics and doing this always set it up like that it works brilliantly right guys hope you have enjoyed this you know little tactic special here it is awesome i am telling you I'm not joking you the goal getter is just an awesome tactic let me know in the comments as well if you've tried it and tell me how well you have did with it if you scored a lot of goals, or maybe doesn't work with every team, not sure. Let me know if it's leaked a lot of goals as well. It's worked fine with me, and I did test it with Liverpool, so one of the top teams. So, you know, let me know as well. So, please, guys, if you could, smash that subscribe button. Give it a clickety, 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 click. Yeah? Press that bell notification so when I bring one of these videos out, 
straight to the top of your screen you can click be one of the first to watch it you know feel the joy and see the joy what this tactic the goal getter is guys only 60 odd percent of you aren't subscribed so that is very very high if you could please press the subscribe button it's free not going to cost you anything is it just help support my channel you know you watch my videos why not press it visit my twitter my facebook my merch store my come hop in the discord come chat with me chat to other people share yeah, your saves your tactics you know all your lovely juicy wonder kids and stuff right guys catch you in the next video